What is going on everyone, my name is Josh and welcome back to another video. In this video we're going to be doing a tutorial on a modification on a mouse, well in my case two mice, I'll be using the Razer 2012 Mamba Wireless Edition and the Gigabyte M8600 V2. In this video I'll be showing you guys how you can custom wrap your own mouse and how easy it is. There's only four simple things you need and I'm pretty sure everybody has. So without further delay, let's get into the video. Okay, so what you'll need is the following. Some wrap of your desire, I'm currently using carbon fiber wrap. Your mouse, a very sharp knife, and a hair dryer. Okay, to start off this little modification, you're going to want to grab your wrap which is already unrolled and heat it up with your heat gun. This is going to make the wrap mold and be a lot easier to stretch over the mouse. After this step, you're going to want to get the wrap and put it over the mouse to see if it fully fits. After you've done this, you want to get the wrap and you want to peel the back so you can expose the sticky bottom. Once the sticky bottom is exposed, you want to put it on top of your mouse and make sure that everything's aligned properly. Then you want to grab your heat gun and put it all over the mouse again to make sure that the wrap's fully heated up and stretchy. Now once it's nice and warm and stretchy, you want to start pulling the wrap and let it go around the sides of the mouse all smoothly. Make sure to get out any air bubbles that are in the mouse. Don't be afraid to consistently use the hairdryer, just make sure you use it moderately and don't let it get too stretchy otherwise you'll rip a hole into the wrap. When you're confident that all the bubbles have been pushed out, grab your hair gun and go over the, all the edges making sure to make them all bend and tuck them all away nicely. This is just going to ensure that the wrap stays there longer and it doesn't just rip off straight away once you've put it on. Now once you've tucked away all your edges, get your X-Acto knife or sharp blade and start cutting between the little edges or the lines on your mouse. Make sure to really do this step very cautiously and carefully because I've already cut my finger doing it and I've already posted a picture of it at the end of this, but it took a little bit of my thumb off. Also not only that, but you don't want to damage your mouse. So when I say carefully, seriously be very careful when you do this step because you don't want to put a massive scratch line in your mouse and make it look ridiculous. Once you've cut the mouse up, grab your hairdryer and go over it one more time around the edges just to make sure that all the edges are nice and firmly put in place. Because again, if you don't do it properly, they're going to come off and it's just going to end up looking terrible. Now hopefully at the end of this guys, you have a nice looking mouse with your favourite wrap on it. Maybe you can customise it to your own liking and make it your own mouse. Anyway guys, that's the end of this video. If you enjoyed it, please like, comment, subscribe. Tell me if you want more of these type of videos in the future. And anyway guys, I'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Don't stop, don't stop.